फ्रेंड्स असलम आर ब्रॉडवे कोर्स बुक फॉर क्लास टू दिस इज़ ऑल्सो बेस्ड ऑन सिंगल नेशनल करिकुलम टू फॉर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी ऑक्सफर्ड इज़ द पब्लिशर लेट्स मूव ऑन टू द फर्स्ट लेसन आफ्टर द कॉन्टेंट्स द लेसन इज ऑन पेज नंबर ट्वेल्व वील स्टार्ट केयरिंग फॉर अदर्स दूसरों का ख्याल रखना वन ऑफ द वेज टू केयर फॉर अदर पीपल इज बाई शेयरिंग द फूड वी ईट हज़रत मोहम्मद रसूल अल्लाह ख़ातिमनबीन सल्लाब वसम ऑलवेज शेयर्ड वॉट एवर ही वॉज ईटिंग विद द पीपल अराउंड हिम डू यू नो एनी अदर वेज इन विच वी कैन केयर फॉर आर कम्यूनिटी नाउ रीड द फॉलोइंग टेक्स्ट दिस इज़ रीडिंग आई एम सेंडिंग यू द रीडिंग सेंड मी द रीडिंग आफ्टर यू हैव रेड इट वंस एंड देन रिकॉर्ड इट सो दैट आई कैन करेक्ट योर मिस्टेक्स इस्लाम is a religion which encourages all muslims to respect the food that we eat and to always share it with others hazrat muhammad rasul allah khatibun nabiyyin sallallahu alaihi wa ashabihi wa sallam always took steps to eat in moderation and to invite his friends and neighbors to share his meals hazrat muhammad رسول اللہ خاتم النبیین صلی اللہ علیہ و آلہ و اصحابہ وسلم did not eat as much as it was possible to eat in one go but insisted on eating in a controlled manner this shows the great importance of having control over our portions and eating habits حضرت محمد رسول اللہ خاتم النبیین صلی اللہ علیہ و آلہ و اصحابہ وسلم gave another great example to his followers about respecting food by never saying anything bad about the food that was given to him if he sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam liked the food it would be eaten and if he sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam disliked it he sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wa sahabihi wasallam would leave it without saying anything all the examples are from the life of hazrat muhammad rasul allah khatim un nabiyin sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wa ashabihi wasallam show how muslims should act with regards to the food that is available to them ab aapne is baat is lesson ko dhyan se sunna hai dobara se main translate karungi islam is a religion which encourages all muslims islam ek aisa mazhab hai jo tamam musalmanon ko encourage de karta hai tasalli deta hai to respect the food जो खाना हमें मिले उसकी इज्जत करने का हमें सिखाता है और हमेशा उसे दूसरों के साथ शेयर करके बांट कर के इस्तेमाल करना चाहिए हज़रत मोहम्मद ऑलवेज टुक स्टेप्स टू ईट इन मॉडरेशन वो हमेशा कम खाते थे एंड इनवाइट एंड टू इनवाइट हिज फ्रेंड्स एंड नेबर्स टू शेयर इज मील्स वो अपना खाना अपने हमसायों और अपने दोस्तों में से शेयर करते थे हज़रत मोहम्मद डिड नॉट ईट एज मच एज इट वॉज पॉसिबल टू ईट वो एक दफ़ा में बहुत ज़्यादा नहीं खा लेते थे बट इंसिसड ऑन ईटिंग इन अ कंट्रोल मैनर बहुत कंट्रोल तरीके से वो खाना खाते थे दिस शोज़ द ग्रेट इम्पॉर्टेंस ऑफ हैविंग कंट्रोल ओवर आर पोर्शन एंड ईटिंग हैबिट्स इससे हमें ये सबक मिलता है कि हमें अपने खाने को कंट्रोल करके खाना चाहिए भूख से थोड़ा सा कम तब भूख जब आपको बहुत ज़्यादा लगी हो तो बहुत ज़्यादा नहीं खा लेना चाहिए और अपनी ईटिंग हैबिट्स को दुरुस्त करना चाहिए हज़रत मोहम्मद गेव एन अदर ग्रेट एग्जाम्पल टू हिज फॉलोअर्स अबाउट रिस्पेक्टिंग फूड वो खाने की बहुत इज्जत करते थे by never saying anything bad about the food that was given to him jo khana unhe diya jata hai uski burai nahi karte the if he liked the food agar unhe khana pasand hota to wo kha lete aur agar nahi pasand hota to chhod dete the bagair kuch kahe all the examples are from the life of hazrat muhammad sallallahu alaihi wa alihi wasallam tamam examples jo nabi pak ki zindagi se hain misalein wo hame ye sikhati hain ki hame khane ki izzat karni chahiye Answer the following questions using a few words or phrases in your notebooks. Name one thing we can do to care for people. दूसरों का जब हमने ख्याल करना है तो हम उनके लिए क्या कर सकते हैं We can care for people by sharing our food with them, by taking care of their problems, by helping them out. Hazrat Muhammad invited whom to share his meals? He invited his friends and neighbors to share his meals. What did Hazrat Muhammad do when he liked the food? जब उन्हें खाना पसंद होता तो वो क्या करते थे Whenever he liked the food, he would eat it, and if he didn't like it, he would leave it. Read the paragraph one and fill in the blanks in these sentences, choosing the correct word from the brackets. One has been done for you. 
Islam is a religion which encourages all Muslims to be respectful with food and to share their food with others. Here the blank is share. Hazrat Muhammad Rasulullah Khatim al Nabiyin always took steps to eat in moderation and to invite his friends and neighbors to share his meals. Next page, page 14. The following words describe different methods that can be used to prevent food wastage. Read the words and discuss how the three R's can be used for food conservation. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Eat food in moderate amounts so that it doesn't get wasted. Reduce, don't waste food. Reuse, you can freeze leftover food to eat it on the next day or later. Recycle, peels of fruit such as bananas can be used as fertilizers. Make a list in your notebook of items that are healthy for your body. Make a separate list of items that you should not eat a lot of, such as junk food. Trace the two examples given below. Healthy foods, unhealthy food. Fruits are healthy, unhealthy food includes chips. Write three sentences about the lessons Muslims can learn from eating habits of Hazrat Muhammad. First thing is you must respect your food. Second, if you don't like it, don't say anything bad about it. Just leave it. Third thing is you must share your food with your friends and neighbors and always eat in moderation. Next is page 15. You have learned about breaking up big words into smaller sounds. This way they are easier to say and to spell. Example, alligator, chimpanzee. Each letter in the alphabet produces an individual sound. Two letters creating one sound is called a digraph. They can be present at the beginning or end of words. Fill in the blanks to create more words using these digraphs. Chair, child, chin, not, no, knowledge, rich, such, which, luck, sick, pluck. Learn to say these words by breaking them up. Submarine, calendar, caterpillar, buffalo. Look at the illustrations. Listen to your teacher talk about a well-known Pakistani figure who cared very much for his country. Discuss other famous figures that you know the names of and what awards they have been given. Now here it is about Major Raja Aziz Bhatti. Read out the passage given below about Major Raja Aziz Bhatti, a military officer who was given the Nishane Heather for his actions during the 1965 war. Draw the attention of the children to the illustration on the page so... They can recognize the face. This is the picture of Major Raja Aziz Bhatti. Major Raja Aziz Bhatti was a military officer in the Pakistan Army who was awarded the Nishane Heather for his bravery during the Battle of Burki in the Second War with India in 1965. He gained officer's commission in the Pakistan Army and was later awarded the Nishane Heather after his martyrdom. Martyrdom is Shahadat. Each year, he is honored in Pakistan on the 6th of September, also known as Defence Day. His life is an example of courage in the face of danger for every Pakistani. Conduct a class discussion about other famous figures that children might know the names of and what awards they have been given. Now our first unit is complete. Please read it again and again and listen to the pronunciation and learn it. Thank you.